We present a standalone wearable system for full body VR avatars. This video demonstrates the use of our system with an example application which features several physics based interaction techniques that are possible using a standalone VR setup with full body tracking. The system is composed of an inertial motion capture suit, Microsoft MR headset, pair of VR gloves and a VR backpack PC. No external trackers or components are required. Our example application was created with Ruiz for Unity Toolkit, which provides a physically simulated avatar prefab as a base for the most common manipulation and locomotion interactions in the virtual world. The avatar prefab is a single rigid body with multiple colliders that are moved with relation to each other so that the avatar always has one-to-one -one mapping with the real body pose. This straightforward implementation allows the avatar to affect the virtual world, while the virtual world can also affect the avatar. For example, the avatar can climb upstairs and fall down from platforms. We also implemented a so-called flexible avatar prefab in order to address instability issues of our naive rigid avatar approach. In this more complex prefab, avatar joint poses are not directly set to match real body poses. Instead, the simulation only seeks to achieve one-to-one -one mapping by applying forces and torques to the joints. Therefore, the objects in the virtual world can deviate the avatar's pose from the real world pose. The flexible avatar is well suited for interacting with computer controlled characters as demonstrated here through this example of martial arts training in VR. The flexible avatar also allows independent relaxing of various body parts like in this case of monkey bar locomotion where airborne virtual legs have ragdoll like behavior. Additionally, grasping objects is much more stable with the flexible avatar. The use of a physics engine in a full body user interface provides common sense affordances within the virtual world, which allows users to employ their everyday knowledge of the real world. With this approach, the user can perform various manipulation tasks naturally. Pushing, rotating, manipulations with fingers and hands, etc. Physics based interaction does not necessarily have to be realistic. Magical interaction is also possible. Avatar and objects can change size, while parameters like mass, friction and bounciness can be anything from zero to unnaturally high values, and so on. Our example implementation also included several physically based locomotion techniques. We argue that when it comes to full body avatar interfaces, VR developers will also benefit from utilizing physics simulation as the base upon which different interaction techniques are built on. Such physics-based approach provides intuitive manipulation and locomotion interactions without requiring individually crafted scripts, which decreases code coupling. Scripts can be still added to refine the interactions if desired. Furthermore, the multiple interaction techniques emerging from physical simulation are congruous with each other, which promotes user interface consistency. With the interaction examples of this video, we want to demonstrate that interaction techniques and to some extent whole computer user interfaces can be created by adjusting physical properties of a simulation. In other words, User interfaces can be implemented via world building and avatar modification. An example of this is a smoothly pursuing third person camera that is attached to the avatar via a simulated spring. Such physics based user interface development is distinct from traditional text based or visual scripting, which tends to be more abstract. Modern game development software include visual 3D editing of colliders, joints, springs, physics materials, and other components of physical simulation. We propose considering these components as 3D user interface building blocks, which could be used more frequently and more methodically by 3D user interface developers.